Ah. Yes. And we're getting recorded. Okay. Now. All right okay. then. So hi everybody. Hi. You are popular. We are starting to record your show. That's what it says. Just so you know. Okay. So we were talking about Batman Beyond and how we very much like that. I heard that, uh, and I heard this on the Batman Beyond DVD set. There was a. Um, I remember that there was a, a special feature about them talking about it, and Bruce Tim saying, you know, when that idea was pitched to them, there was, you know, they were wondering whether or not uh, Bruce Wayne should be dead, you know, since it's so far into the future. And he said at that moment he just put his fist down and said, Bruce Wayne will never die. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if he's 120, he's going to be alive. He said, I will never kill Bruce yeah, Wayne. Never. Which I yes. really appreciate it. And then he said he calmed down and was. then everyone realized, okay, and they backed and off. They went, from okay, fine. Kind of so, yeah. yeah, so that's why Bruce mm -hmm. Wayne is old, yes. but still around. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. So, uh, yeah, exactly, like Aunt May. Yeah, I don't think Aunt May is ever good. They tried to kill Aunt May at well, one point. they did, but they, didn't they? It just didn't work for some people. They just said, no, they brought her back. I remember the did last the time Aunt excuse. May was in peril. I mean, that worked out great for everybody, didn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, in one more day. That was just fantastic. Yeah. Aunt May is, what, 90? They couldn't let her just have a peaceful death? I mean, yeah. she's been having operations for 30 years now, you think? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Any, anyway. It's all the prune juice, I guess. But, um, yeah, it's kind of, let's see, Uncle Ben is back now? Is I didn't he? hear that. No, I don't, <laughs> I haven't, haven't heard okay, about that. I, now I know I Bucky's feel back, but I haven't heard anything sure? about Uncle ben is Jason back? Todd's back, Bucky's back, Bucky's but I haven't back heard about the, uh, the Winter Soldier? Uncle Ben, yeah. Yeah. That's not from House of M. Uh, we read mm -hmm. House of M. Uh, Uncle Ben was not back. Uh, he, well, he was back in that reality when they well, changed yes. everything. I think. But, I think he was. But then know. didn't he die again? Well, yeah, when everything went back to normal. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. That's like when Stacy coming back. That's a little bit... I'm a little thrown right now by that. Yeah. As in a fake version? Oh. Mm. No more clones. Yeah. It's they learned their the lesson, haven't it's they learned their the lesson on Spider-Man at least? <laughs> yeah. Gwen is not back. Gwen Stacy is not back. No. No, Gwen. No, I mean she had plenty of clones going on. I know at the time, but uh, you know. Uh. Let's see. Um, okay. A Weapon X plot coming soon? Uh, I don't know. Don't know exactly right now. We're uh, we're working on summer stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So, we're that stuff is uh, we're talking about it, but um, it's too early on right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So um, well, I don't know. Should we go into a? Well, no. I think maybe we should let everybody settle a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Um, just some people. One are more thing is people are still connection. People yeah. Are arriving. People are yeah. still coming. Uh, one one thing I want to make sure that uh, everybody knows about, um, and I know it's the topic right now from Spidey Mouse is there's a new fan website, yes. which we we went to and um, it's great, it's fantastic. <laughs> it looks it's, really cool. It's awesome. Yeah. yeah. So we gotta Very thank cool. Spidey Mouse and everyone at mm -hmm. the fan club who put that together. It looks really good. An actual site. It's just some random fan site dot com. Yes. Now, see, we don't really even have one of those yet, but our fan club does, mm -hmm. which is great. Mm-hmm. Yes. So it's uh, yeah. I mean, and it looks it looks great. It's it's <laughs> it's the kind of site I think we wish we had. Exactly. Or wish we yeah. Could have put up ourselves or whatnot. But we, um, we still might someday we, have yeah. a, a website. We did buy the name. We um, have the name. Yes, yeah. it's just some random guy dot com. We just we're we're still waiting to try to get stuff going with it. Just yeah, exactly. I mean, I, I don't know what we're waiting for exactly, but you know, we might at some point. Um, so go yes. and visit the fan site. It's mm -hmm. a lot of fun, and uh, I can't wait to go on there myself and see mm -hmm. what they do. Mm -hmm. And they're still, you know, it's just getting started. It looks great. So thank mm -hmm. you, Spidey Mouse. Yes, and, uh, and Dr. Plexi, yes, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> so, uh, so anyway, yeah, so yeah, check it out. There's and Spidey Mouse. You wrote. I, I loved what you wrote. It was it was almost touching what you wrote yes. is the uh, the intro for uh, the thing. And he's on the phone, so he's not listening anyway. So <laughs> it's okay, cool. But uh, yeah, appreciate it. Uh, anyway, moving on. 
Let's see. What does that mean? Somebody just turned red there. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so any more questions with we get settled in before we mm -hmm. get into topics and such? Yes. And there will be more random gal ranting, yes. Did hear Mickey Rourke is, I think he's Whiplash. I don't know if it's confirmed it's a combo of Whiplash and um, Crimson Dynamo or something. His name's something Ivan. Like I that. believe he's, I believe he might be Russian. I don't know, but his name is Ivan, so it sounds kind of Russian. But uh, Basically, but, yeah. we can't um, really tell by the, from the way he looks who he exactly is supposed to be. Mm -hmm. So, I guess we'll see. The Kick-Ass movie. I haven't read Kick-Ass, the, the comic books yet. I heard they're cool, but uh, um, based on that, I think the movie could very well be cool, but I haven't read it yet, so I don't know don't know what to think about that. This, sorry, our computer keeps going dark, the screen. House 24 Heroes. House and Heroes, yes, 24, waiting to... Uh, Start at the beginning and then and then move forward. We with missed twenty four in the beginnings and yeah. uh, just never caught up. But we do watch House and Heroes. Mm -hmm. Yes. We saw Heroes yesterday. Didn't see House yet. So please, no more spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, but then again, what is there left to spoil? Yes. Exactly. Right. Yeah. Um, Let's see. I have not seen The Big Bang Theory, but I mean, I know it's about the point of view of, of geeks. It's centered about some Thank geek you. fanboys, geeks. But uh, but that's cool, you know. I uh, I have not, but we haven't seen. seen maybe one some point we'll check it out. I don't know. I haven't. I don't know what I've I've heard good or bad things about it yet. Not I don't know. Smallville. I, well, I've seen some Smallville. I have too. Um, and and you know some of it's cool. I have not. Uh, but I don't know. Just never got around to watching it on a regular basis. So uh, I don't know. When Smallville started, I was in college. I was very, very. Uh, we were both. Uh, we were very busy. So I, I think maybe that's why we missed some of. Um, we we didn't start watching because if that show were to begin right now, I think we would watch it um, mm -hmm. more regularly. But again, we missed a bunch of stuff. But you know, I've seen episodes here and there. Yeah. Tell you a funny story about Smallville. I don't know if you guys know this at all, but uh, I read somewhere that uh, the guy who created it, um, he's the guy that, not the director of, I can't remember his name, Tim McAn Tim McAndles? Or the McAndles? guy who created it but was pissed off about how it was executed, so his name yeah. is not on the show. That right. guy. He wrote, yeah. he wrote the, uh, the film The Iron Giant. Uh, Which is, for, by the way, if you have Brad seen, Bird, if you Brad Bird directed seen. it, but this guy wrote it. Go watch the the Iron Giant. So he 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 was originally going to create a show called Bruce Wayne, and mm -hmm. it was about Batman and training before he became Batman. It was actually all going to be from that point of view, and it was uh, it was all going to be you know him training and going to different parts of the world to learn fighting and detective skills Batman, and all sorts yeah. of stuff. And him not about you know, Batman, kind of like Smallville, not right. about Batman, but about Bruce Wayne. Right. And uh, and the WB said, oh, that sounds cool. So they were like, okay, yeah, let's go with that. And they developed they developed the whole season. And during that, they developed a, a two-part episode that was called Smallville, mm -hmm. in which Bruce Wayne would visit some, Smallville, Kansas, a part yeah. of where some of his business was in Smallville, mm -hmm. Kansas. And it was meant to be kind of a, a running gag that because Batman or Superman, they never say their names because they don't exist yet, but he would... For some reason, in, in trying to solve this mystery of some sort, he would keep running into this, this Clark Kent kid, kid and he was like, Clark, how did yeah. he get here so yeah, fast, exactly. and just all sorts of stuff. So it was meant to be kind of an in-joke for those of you who knew, which I'm sure most people would. But um, anyway, that was like a two-part episode at some point. And, uh, but, and they were about to go ahead with it when then suddenly uh, Warner Brothers Film Division said, no, nope, we, we, we want to hang on to Batman just in the films. We don't want to do anything with him and television until we know exactly. what we're doing, so we're going to hold off on that. So they said, but we're not even calling him Batman. Exactly. We're calling him Bruce Wayne. He exactly. doesn't have to be like that. And they said, no, we're going to play it safe and sorry. So, okay. So he went back and he took the Smallville two-part episode and developed that into a show. They figured salvage what you can, I and guess. That was the mentality. For some reason, they were okay with, with Superman, Superman being franchise. used. And I, I don't know why, but they said, okay. So then they asked, they said, okay. If, he said, I don't mind. I'll be, everything will be fine. My one request is that you don't cast 26-year-old underwear models as teenagers in high school. And they said, well, that's too bad because that's exactly what we're going to do. So they, uh, they went ahead and did it, and he said, then take my name off of the series. So he did. He still gets a check for it, 
And uh, he says every time it comes, his wife says, hey, you should get screwed over deals more often because it's paying well. So 